Hello everybody, this is Noah from Patronovich Gaming and welcome back to Pokemon Infinite Fusion. We just beat Brock last time and now we're gonna go and uh, see what else we can do. So come along for the ride. Let's see what this guy say. Did you check out the museum yet? No. Really? You have to go. Yeah, entrance is free and there's a bunch of collections of fossils. Is this a museum? No, this is just some random house. What? Team Rocket is at Mount Moon? Huh? I'm on the phone. Scram! Wow. Rude. Poo poo! Sorry. Poo poo poo! It's supposed to be Jigglypuff, not poo poo poo! Yawn, when Jigglypuff sings, Pokemon get drowsy. I guess it works on humans too. Snore. Picture of a rock type on the screen. What's on this screen? Nothing but trash in there. What did you expect? What? It's... It's a TV, isn't that? Isn't it? I thought that was... Maybe I'm wrong? This is the gym, okay. So then... Oh, uh, this must be the museum. The museum. Welcome to Peter C's museum. The entrance is free. Enjoy our fossil collections. Yep. Oh, Uma star. Yep. Dome fossil. Kabuto. Aerodactyl. I feel like it's a pretty small display case for an aerodactyl, but whatever. Helix fossil. Almanite. Oh, what is this? DNA of a rock type Pokemon remains completely preserved, even after a million years of fossilization. Because of this, these Pokemon can be genetically cloned to delaying creatures. A feat that will be impossible to achieve. Prehistoric Pokemon of other types. Hello, young trainer. I will teach you to move Mud Slap with one of your Pokemon for free if you can answer this quiz about Pokemon fossils. What do you think? Sure. Which fossil can be revived in the Pokemon Kabuto? Dome? Duh. What is the only fossil Pokemon that cannot evolve? Aerodactyl? Come on. So this Pokemon can be re regenerated from the Jaw Fossil? Oh shoot, I don't know this one. Um. Ha! It was Tyrant, I guess. Cool. So one of my Pokemon can learn Mud Slap. Rattat can learn Mud Slap. And Hoot Hot. Sure, Hoot Hot. Yeah. What are we going to get rid of? We're going to get rid of String Shot. And poof. Hoot Hot forgot how to use String Shot. Yeah, use that Mud Slap, Hoot Hot. Million years. That's 40,000 generations of humans back to back. Some of the fossils here lived several hundreds times that amount of years ago. Different fossil Pokemon lived during the different time periods. For example, Ammonite and Kabuto both lived in the Kanto a long time ago, but they lived millions of years apart from each other. Thanks. We're not just a museum, we also do a lot of research on Pokemon fossils. We have a machine that can revive prehistoric Pokemons from fossils. Okay. That was a complex looking machine. Better not touch it. Oh, what? Okay. Okay. Um, my Pokemon trainer? I brought back this special flute from my travels. Show me the city's badge and it's yours. That's it! That's the city's badge! Here you go, as promised! The black flute. What does that do? This whose melody makes Pokemon less likely to appear. Played in a cave in some forests. I shall go now. We might meet again. What's this guy? You're allowed to forfeit the match at any given time. If you have a rematch, cool. Cool. 
different Pokemon come out at night. I think I already saw that. Oh, okay. Stop by a hotel. Okay. Since you're saying I have to. Most major cities in Kanto have hotels like this one. We're even finding people to help or simply to rest to make time pass faster. People who have lost things often come to hotels to seek help from traveling Pokemon trainers. They always hang out on the top floor of hotels and they give you rewards for helping them, so don't miss out. Welcome to Pewter City's Hotel. It's $50 for a room. Would you like to rent a room? I don't have $50. Whoa. Hello, you must be new here. In many cities, you'll find hotels just like this one. What? Why do you think I'm new here? Local residents gather here when they seek the help of traveling Pokemon trainers such as yourself. People usually hand out great rewards to trainers who help them, so you don't want to miss out. Use this journal to help you keep track of quests you've accepted. I didn't know this. we were going into side quests. As for me, I'll give you, also give you rewards for helping a certain number of people. These are your current stats according to my intel. Yeah, you just gave it to me! Oh my gosh. You literally just gave me the thing. Of course I have a zero. It's noticeably empty. I don't care. I want something, though. Bug-type Pokemon are my favorite. I want to become a strong trainer using only bugs. Can you please show me a fully evolved bug-type Pokemon? I'll give you something cool if you do. I don't... Nope, okay, that's fine. This should be a full view, but bug, bug type, I'll give you something cool. Hi, are you a Pokemon trainer? I want to make some wild mushrooms too, but I'm afraid I can't. I'm afraid you're going to be really forced to pick them because of wild Pokemon. Would you have to help me out? I'll give you something in return and to make it worth your while. Fantastic! To make my stew, I'd need three tiny mushrooms. Hey, I need your help. I lost my revive while sitting on a bench earlier, and I'm worried sick. I've never been able to defeat Brock without it. I'll never be able to defeat Brock without it. Please, won't you help me find it? Oh, thank you so much. I've been on so many benches today. I don't know which one I lost it. But it's gotta be somewhere in Pewter City for sure. I'm counting on you. Oh my goodness. Looks like this is a side quest episode. So we're gonna start with the easiest one, which is checking every bench. No! Fuck! Rumpelstiltskin! It's me! Professor Oak's assistant! I was doing some field work around here and I came across something! Incredible! You've really got to see this. It seems like there's an outbreak of wild Pokemon with hidden abilities on this route. I saw one of them in this very patch of grass. You can tell when a root has a hidden ability outbreak by the way wild Pokemon sparkle in battles. This is a very rare event. We're lucky to be witnessing it so close to home. But I don't expect it to last for a very long time either, so you should try to catch one of these rare Pokemon while you still have the chance. Well, I'm headed to Cerulean City for some field work, so I better get going. It's right on the other side of Mount Moon. Maybe I'll catch you there. Good luck with your Pokemon League challenge. Well, looks like I guess I have no choice. Oh, a Mankey that's sparkly? Okay. Ha! Poison powder! Oh no, do I not have any... Tell me I've got Pokeballs. 13, okay. And one Premier Ball. Okay. Oh! Okay. Take that premier ball! Mankey's data was added to the Pokédex. Cool. Of course! Who wouldn't want to name it? This one's, this one's easy. Easy. His name is Monkey, because it's a monkey. Super easy. 
I think so. I was wanting to trade for a Spiro, so. Oh, fuck. It doesn't affect the Spiro? Are you kidding me? Okay. Come on, buddy. Maybe you'll have better luck. Maybe. Wrong button. I always do it. Every time. Oh no, I'm so scared you growled at me. It's a bird! How does a bird growl? Oh, it doesn't affect the Spiro? Okay. Ha! Take that. Mm. Whoa, of course, I, I have to. Um. Speedo. Ha! Welcome to the team, Speedo. Make you survive the poisoning. Poison faded away. Good to know. I was wondering what that, like, blinking was, but I was like, eh, whatever, it's probably fine. Yes, restore my Pokemon. Okay, here we go. Treat tree for a Mankey, what do you think? Super sweet, so it's going to help me out a lot against Brock. Monkey. For Rumpelstiltskin's monkey, Ted sends Tyson. Ted bids farewell to Tyson. Take good care of Tyson. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's cool. They changed its sprite. That's pretty cool. You can do it, Rita. With enough training, we can finally defeat Brock. Yeah, I doubt it, bro. Wait, wait. Wait a second. Is that a bench? Tried building Brock so many times, but he's just too tough. Okay. Hmm. Aha! I found his revive! I wonder who this could belong to. I bet I know. So did you find my revive yet? You did? Whoa, thank you so much! Brock will be a cakewalk with this item. Here, please accept this as a thank you gift. Frustration. Cool. I already- I'm already frustrated, but thanks anyway. These are your current stats, according to my intel. Accept a quest 3 and progress 2. Complete quest 1. How do I know what that? <laughs> That's my secret. Also, there's one more thing. It's a gift for having helped so many people. One. Uh, Flash. <laughs> I already know how to do that.
Yeah. Yes, we'll trade. Why? Have you seen the Pokemon Spearow? I'll trade you my Bell Sprout for it. Yes. That's a Spiro. Maybe it needs to rest for a second or something? I don't know. Why can't it be chosen? Why can't it be chosen? Alright, whatever. Um... That's the case. I don't like Spiro. Get it out of my face. Okay. Just want to make sure there's none hiding in there. Yeah, we're going to exit from the box. We're going to withdraw. Man, I don't like any of these. We're gonna go try to catch a new one. A new Pokemon. We're gonna go ahead and speed this up. We're gonna look for mushrooms and catch Pokemon and level up our guys in the wild, so.
Yeah, here you go. Balm a mushroom, okay, cool. Give us a nice fragrance. A maniac will buy it for a high price. Might just hold on to that. Okay, heal up, let's go. Come on, I want to catch and splice something. Gotta have, a, gotta have a new splice, you know? Bro, are you kidding me right now? Need a ran, okay, okay. I'll take this, I'll take this, come on. Okay, okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yes! Yeah, let's get that Nidoran! Nah, this no. Um, er, yes, yes, of course, of course. Uh. No to ran. Here we go. We're gonna use a DNA splicer. Ah, uh, shit. Ah. Uh. Which one? You know, we're just gonna do it this way. Or do we want it to be like this? 
You know what? No, we're going to do this. Yes. The Pokemon are being fused. Your, your Pokemon were fused into Tyran. Tyran's data was added to the Pokedex. Tyran becomes stressed out. They do not get to train every day. When it rages, it releases a horrible toxin from its horn. Okay, fighting and poison. Uh, we're gonna go to poison point. Noto ran, learn tackle. Learned helping hand. Is trying to learn fake out. No, it, well. Let's see what moves we have. Growl, which I don't really care too much about. Scratch, tackle. These are assists and ally by boosting the power of attack. Attack that's first and makes the target flinch only works first turn if the user is in battle. Okay. So we're gonna get rid of Growl. Learn Foresight. I don't really care about Foresight. Nodoran! Okay. So we will heal up and yeah. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I know this episode was more of a montage episode, so you know I. Sorry that it was a big montage episode and I didn't get much comedy out of it or story, but I did a couple side quests, tried to exchange the Spearow, but it, for some reason it didn't work. So uh, I guess we'll see what happens next time. Hopefully I'll make it to Cerulean and I can kick Misty's ass. If I'm allowed to say that. Anyway, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, tell me, you know, give me Pokemon names. Give me something down in the comments, you know, something to work with. Uh, tell me what you want to see, what you don't want to see, you know, anything else. And thank you all so much for watching. You have a wonderful rest of your day, morning, evening, what, evening night, whatever time it is. And I will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.